morning and welcome to day 12. I got up at about half four I think. Lily was still fast asleep and I just had to get ready. I had to get ready myself and start packing because I didn't do as much as I thought I was going to do yesterday. It was kind of like when Richard came home, I kind of just stopped and we just didn't do anything. Um, so it was a bit of a mad rush this morning. Richard's now loading up the car with the stuff. And uh, yeah, hopefully we've got everything. As long as Lily's got everything, that's all that matters. So yeah, we're gonna get going in a very short while. Okay, so we're at the service station. I'm not, we're at the service station. We're at a petrol station. Um, apparently since Richard's been away, which has been eight weeks, I've done just over 120 miles. <laughs> I didn't travel much. Um, I'm now gonna edit yesterday's because I haven't even looked at it. Um, so I thought I could edit that on the way there. Um, so yeah, and I can open up to this face. <laughs> so we are how far into the journey? An hour, half hour. Half an hour, here's Richard. Lily is playing with Pinker. And uh, she's had a little sleep and then we're gonna step, stop at the next services to have some, well, for Lily to have a breakfast. We've had breakfast, Richard made bacon sandwiches. Are you gonna have anything else? Are we still? What about guts, no. Oh yeah. Richard can't handle spicy food anymore. Hey. Now we can't handle it, it's getting old. Fucks up the innards. Meaning, but we've got to get used to the rain because... 29 miles. It's basically they're gonna rain the whole time we're there. But we've got our waterproofs. And I, yesterday, I looked at the web um, and it said, I thought it said 87 mile per hour winds, but it was an 87% chance of raining. So, <laughs> I believe I got that wrong. Um, cool, could you, I told that to Mum, but Mum did actually question it. She was just like, oh, bloody hell. <laughs> Okay, so I've edited a little bit of yesterday's vlog. Um, it's just my, I, I'm trying to do it in the car and it's giving me a little bit of a headache, so I think I'll stop for a while. Must remember our What's house. Get in the other lane, man. About two miles an hour. Sunday it's drivers, it's only. Saturday, Spice World, the movie. <laughs> So we are here 
and we're in Weymouth. Yay! Lily is blending in nice with her khaki colours. <laughs> oh yeah, we better be careful of the radiator. No, don't touch. Don't touch that, please. <gasps> what can you see? Yeah. Good girl. <laughs> You're so cute, aren't you, hey? Mm -hmm. I love you. Richard and Lily are settled in. She's found the remote controls. We're here in Weymouth town. It is raining, but it's not as bad as it could be doing it's raining. Richard's pushing Lily. And Lily's got a rain cover on for the first time. So yeah, we're gonna walk along the harbour. And then we're just gonna get some supplies because we've got like no tea or coffee and stuff. Shrek, Shrek yeah. All made of wame of sand. What you got there, JD? A hot chocolate, salted caramel cheesecake. What you got? Cappuccino. Oh, the actual coffee beans. Oh, so we've just stopped for a drink. It's not raining as bad as it was before, is it? He's not talking. Huh? It's not raining as bad as it was. No, it's all right. But I'm glad I bought this jacket because it's very waterproof. So we're now going to walk along the harbour. doing way with any justice here am I? Ooh. Oh dear. Oh, it was it was wet but enjoyable I'd say. What do you think Richard? Uh, yeah, it was all right. Good evening. It's quarter eight and Lily has just gone to bed. Um, I was a bit worried about her going to bed because it was a new place, new cot and I just was worried, but she's been all right, I suppose. She has had a fall. She's banged her head three times today. Once when we were at home just before we left, she was trying to climb up the washing machine and she banged her face on the washing machine and then fell on the floor and banged the back of her head. And then she's banged her head on um, a door frame and then she was climbing up the TV unit and fell down from that and she scratched her face. So I think she's gonna have a scratch and a bruise on her face in the morning. Bless her heart. Um, I'm off. So I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.